thought I would share with you how I sometimes use Photoshop before I paint. I don't always work this way, but I thought you might find it interesting to see the thought process. These digital tools like Photoshop and Procreate are great for experimenting with color and moving rocks and trees around, but it's pretty easy to get carried away. Photos tend to flatten color and depth, so I usually grab the foreground and saturate it and introduce warmer colors into the foreground. I'll also play with the composition quite a bit if I feel like it needs it. For example, in this piece I've added more rocks to the foreground and trimmed some trees just to open up the scene a little bit more. I rarely end up copying exactly from the photo, but this gives me a good idea of where I'm headed and minimizes pushing paint around and saves some frustration in the painting process. In case you're wondering where this photo was taken from, it's on the Sea to Sky Trail near Squamish, BC. That's How Sound down below. Hang on to the end of the video and you can see the final painting. Thanks for watching.